have that Scotland Yard. Gosh, you don't suppose that Scotland Yard is close to there as well, do you? Of course not, Ernest. Criminals don't take the day off, so neither can the police. No rest for the wicked. I wonder if Inspector Hastings is back here already. I do hope he's married to get that burglar. We could ask the bo that Bobby outside the building if he knows. Yeah, I think Bob is another word, for English word for police officer. I think I could be wrong. Though. Snow globe. Okay, this one's a bit out of place, but whatever. Okay, it's the middle building. Really? No hit coins? Maybe one here? Okay. Okay, at least one hit coin here. Thank Christ. Ah, two hit coins. Okay, okay. Now the world is... Uh... Aha! I knew it was gonna be one event in the Big Bang. This guy here probably has a puzzle. Yes? Hello there. What are you doing outside Scotland Yard? I was trying to sell my papoyos, but they said it's not allowed because it's a bank holiday. Oh dear, poor you. I'm not sure that's how it works, but okay. You know, I had a letter from my family in San Grillo, and they sent me a new puzzle. Would you like to solve it? One, one, three, a long conversation. Apparently this one is hard, okay. Uh, let's see. A man and his partner are having a strange conversation. The man said to his partner, It was our 7th anniversary on 30 June last year, and it will be our 10th anniversary, 10th anniversary next, year, next year. What was the day they broached this topic? Select the boxes to input the mo month and day. The anniversary in question happens once, every, once per year every year, no more and no less. Uh. I'm starting to figure out. Because the only way this makes sense, because you said, he, he never specified when he said this, just it was like an onset year. So it was 7th anniversary on the 30th last year, and it will be the 10th anniversary next year. What if he's talking about on December? 31st and that way if they're talking close to midnight it will go to the to what's the name it will go to January 1st of the next year mm, this should do it I think puzzles are made for solving yeah I can definitely see why this one's considered more difficult than the others you did it the date changed in the middle of the conversation and continue to the new year so you start a conversation on the 31st, 31 December, on the year of the 8th anniversary. Makes sense. A long conversation. Puzzles like that don't take long for me to work out. Wow, you are amazing! Maybe you are so happy, you want to buy a paponio? Oh, I would. But it's God on this day. Sorry. No you wouldn't, cat. Stop being be mean to the poor guy. I see you don't have the day off even though it's a bank holiday, PCB. Or BT. Hello, hello, quite right, Miss God Miss. Godwin's Day means nothing to us coppers, haha. But we all knew what we were getting into in this game, so no complaints. Keeping the public safe is our number one priority, as you know. Gosh, what a noble attitude. Not that I'd say no to a lie in the, in the opportunity present itself, of course. I'm only human. But the good people of only come first. We must have our priorities straight. Well, I think you're doing a wonderful job, officer. On behalf of all honors, honors I thank you. Haha, <laughs> you're too kind, lad, too kind. You swear like those that helped me, be me beat the alarm o'clock in the morning. I don't suppose you know if Inspector Hastings has come back to the yard yet, do you? I do apologize, madame. 
But I've only just arrived at my post. I've yet to see the inspector today. Oh well, perhaps there might be somebody inside who knows. Yes, let's go and have a look. Oh, it seems bitter in here than ever. No sign of Inspector Hastings down here, though. Perhaps he's still chasing that thief. There's a detect detective who came to find the old super, super snitch before. Look. Yes, you're right, Show. Well, if he's here, perhaps the inspector is back after all. I was gonna ask him, shall we? What the? How did you move here so fast, PCB? And now you have a puzzle. Hello, hello, hello. I'm. Ah, impeccable timing. I, I was wondering what the hell that was. As always, Miss Layton. Oh, did you need me for something, Constable? Indeed, I did and I do. There was a chap in here who no longer ago and left this puzzle behind. But it's got me all tied up in knots. I can't make any sense of it whatsoever. A brother's homecoming. Okay. Two brothers left home for school at 9 o'clock in the morning. The older brother came home at 6 in the evening. But when did the younger brother return? The younger brother came home later than the older brother. Select the correct answer. Three weeks later. But it doesn't make any sense. Because this one here all this one here looks like the correct answer, but it isn't. Because if you count from... 9 to... If you add 7 hours to 9... It's pretty much you know. It doesn't actually make sense because one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Mm. Let's go with this just to be safe. This is an interesting one. Puzzles are made for solving. Luck! You are on my side when I least want it to be. Why can't I win the lottery with this? You did it! The brothers came home on different days. Oh. You know... Mm. Yeah, no, I don't... I don't like that. Don't... Don't. The point of this puzzle was to realize that the younger brother came... Could have come home the fall day after school camping trip or the like. Sneaky. No, it's not. It's just you literally... Don't give all the information and expect people to actually try and guess with little to nothing. The only reason this puzzle is even remotely possible is because there, the answers are there. Had it not been for that, it's literally impossible for you to guess. Look at that! You certainly get that little stinker short shrift, didn't you? Haha, <laughs> well, Constable puzzles are my specialty. You could teach me a thing or two when it comes to puzzles, Miss Layton. I think a thing or three, in fact. Yeah, no, I'm not actually happy with that puzzle. I don't think I've ever seen this one here before. This one, yeah, I think this one I've already seen. What about this here? Wait. Oh, thanks for the hint coins. Ah, hello there. Um, oh yes, Miss Layton. Sorry for interrupting you for. Not at all. So, did you manage to get the culprit in the breaking that was reported? Um, well, according to my notes, um, ah yes. I was called away to another incident before I was before it was involved, so I can't tell you much, I'm afraid. Inspector Ace is back, though, in his office, I believe. Does that mean he's already solved the case? Well, let's go and find him and see how he's getting on. I'd say probably not very well, is he? Yeah, I just realized the photo here. Yeah, I no wonder I never actually, never actually seen her before. Or never I can notice her face before. Cause look, the photo is supposed to be of her, it's pretty much covered by the lights. 
also just realized what the heck is this thing supposed to be a typewriter? It's okay, I get it. I get the. This series is, from what I understand, it's portrayed in the. I want to call it very old, but some time ago. So stuff like cell phones probably don't exist or aren't a commodity most people can have. At least you have these rotary phones here. Ah, DC Booker was right. The inspector is back. Look. Ah, Cat, hello. Have you been here long? I've only just got back myself. No, we've just arrived. Did you manage to catch our man? Of course. With a little help from Joe Public. But we nicked him right in my life. Well, that's good news. What sort of help? Well, he was a little critter, this one. And quick on his pins. Pins? What? He ran off to the par to into this park, you see. But he could because it's Garden's Day, the place was packed, so I had an idea. I shouted out. That fellow's a thief, and with that all the people in the park went after him. Okay. I get what you're going for, and yes, I can help, but I also forget that a thief could be armed with something like a gun or a knife at least. So yeah, shouting for the public to uh, to, uh, to at least see that there's a thief for them to intercept, not the brightest idea, but I suppose an emergency could work. They soon had him surrounded, and then all I had to do was let the cuffs on Gosh, that really is help from the public, isn't it? Yeah, we'd have lost him otherwise, I think. Anyway, more importantly, have you, come, have you come up with a present for Miss Aces yet? Not yet, I'm afraid, Inspector. As you discovered for yourself, everywhere is close today. Oh, I didn't ask if that's what you'd say. Don't be defeated, Inspector. No, over yet. We still, we still have time before nightfall. Yeah, but there is no hope of getting a present, is there? Even f every flaming shop in the city is shut. And it's too late for it to go trapping further afield. I don't see what else I can do. It's too soon to give up. There may be other ways of obtaining a present that we haven't thought of yet. We'll keep thinking of looking out for something that Felicity would like. Well, thanks, Cat. Beats me why you're going into such a lot of trouble to help me, but I appreciate it. It's quite simple. I'm doing it because I want to. Blimey, you sure aren't too nice to be a detective? Oh, sorry. Blimey, you sure you aren't too nice to be a detective, Cat? Anyway, what have you got in mind? Where are you going to find a present, eh? Yes, I'm starting to think the answer doesn't lie in the shops. But I have an inkling that someone I know may be able to help. Oh, who's that then? All in good time, Inspector. I need to head over to Guildhall for now. Guildhall? Yes, always all I can promise the person in question will be there, of course. Alright, well, just down the road, so I'll come along with you. Uh, sorry. Public support. Hmm. Yeah, I'm, I do hope this this part here is, is the last one, but I hear if it's gonna be this one and these two. Not in that order, of course. Man, Guildhold is... Guildhold? Guildhold is far. <laughs> why do you still have the baby with you? Man, I can't have the baby here, but why do you still have the right man thing for him to... Ugh. Oh, alright. Uh, oh, wait. Aha! Hint coin. Wait. There's a third one also on the flag. Ah! It is! I was gonna say, what is the point? But no, I'm, I'm not happy with it. So let's see. Ah. Uh, mm, I think we want to talk to Lonida, a pepper. Piper, I think is her name. 
So let's talk with Caesar first. Yeah, he has a puddle, so it's probably not him. Oh, Mr. Chance, what a pleasant surprise. Are you out for a stroll? Ah, I'm glad I've bumped into you, Miss Layton. I bought some baby goods the other day, and you, there was a freak puddle with them. Okay, I can somewhat see why there would be a free puddle, because again, it's a good way to stimulate the baby's mind. But uh, your baby's license is just three months old. I don't think you'd be able to solve any, anything very complicated anytime soon. I know how much you enjoy this sort of thing. Here, it's all yours. Sand Pit Dice Dilemma. Some children have been rolling dice around in a sand pit leaving patterns in the sand. Now the imprint for one side of a particular die has been obliterated. So whose die made the marks? There are six designs used on the side of the dice, and each die has exactly one of each design. But every die is different. Uh, there's... Oh, okay, is it this one that's gonna obliterate? Is that what it means? Okay, yeah, this one makes it a lot easier to see. Now, let's see. Much, much, much later. Okay. So, yeah, there are probably sides here that we cannot see, because, again, dice are uh, supposedly three-dimensional. But one thing I didn't notice here is that all of them have a heart except her showing. And the only symbol here that isn't actually shown here, look, there is a, uh, what is a tree, a smiley face, a diamond, a cross, a square, nothing here, and another diamond. So maybe it's this one here, just because, I get it, because it would be all for the, all three of them to have hearts. Hearts showing, and this one being the only one, that's the outlier, especially considering the heart that's supposed to be on the, what's on the sand pit isn't there. So, hopefully this one. This should do it, I think. Any mystery or any puzzle solved. Nice. You did it. The clover design was the key to this puzzle. Huh? Ah, okay, okay. Hmm. I was kind of right, so I'm glad with that. Aren't you lucky, my little munchkin? You got to see the, the detective solving that lovely puzzle puzzle, didn't you? Haha, <laughs> your baby is very cute. I can see you are so infatuated with him. It would be impossible not to be, wouldn't it? I don't understand how they come out looking so adorable. Uh, I'm pretty sure they don't. Do you understand the little cutesy wootsy? Do you, do you, do you? Oh. There are a lot of these collectibles here. Musical bo box of memories. Oh, um, hello. Oh, hello, Miss Tate, I believe, isn't it? Are you working even on God Wednesday? Oh, um, no, no, I don't think so. Oh, then why are you here? Well, you see, I'm... Um, I just uh, on my way home from visiting my, um, my grandma. Oh, that explains it! I thought it was rather queer to find you here. Are you, um, working? Even though it's a bank holiday, I mean? Well, sort of, yes. It's not exactly work as such, but... I, uh, um, see. Well, I hope you manage to find some time to, um, relax. You're as busy as the mayor. Ah, is Mayor Loanida in today? Oh, um, let me see, um, I am... Um, yes! I think I saw her heading to her chamber when I passed by here this morning. So she's probably in there working now. I should think. Maybe. Well, um, if you'll excuse me, I have to get going, getting along now. Of course, thank you for your help. I had a feeling Piper would be here, or Piper, or whatever the hell, the hell, whatever the hell she calls her, calls her, would be here even today. She's so devoted to her job, that woman. So you're here to see the mayor, are we? Yes, I feel sure she's going to have some advice for us. Hmm. Interesting idea. All right, then. Let's see what she suggests.
Hello, Piper! Oh, she's not here. Perhaps she's gone home already? Gone home? Blast! I was really hoping she'd be able to save the day. Hmm. I wonder where she might have gone. Aha, I've got it. I know where she'll be. Really, miss? Where? Just a stone's throw from where we are now. It's one of the mayor's favorite places. I, I can think... What do you mean? Don't you remember looking out over the city lights with her before, Ernest? I mean, yeah, sure, except he wasn't actually there in the cuts, so probably not. Ah, of course, the balcony. Exactly, let's have a peek outside and see if my instincts are right. But wouldn't you have been able to see her from the... from outside, if that was the case? Hint coin, nice. Hint coin, nice. Uh... Nope, not hint coin, but yeah, interesting info. Hint coin, nice. Now let's go here. 